a problem last night and we're trying to figure it out. We have a we have an issue, right Finn? So you guys might be able to see. Hey Storm. So you guys might be able to see. There are some yeah, cuts he's got there. all these cuts. So basically when he gets cuts like this, I take Storm away from him. But Sam doesn't think that Storm caused this. What do you guys think? Can you see it? He could have rubbed it on a tree. So Sam thinks that... Mom, that one last night looked really deep. Yeah, like those are bad. Sam thinks that those are caught, those are from uh, scratches that Finn's been in the bushes, but we don't know. We can't tell. That's my thought. That's what you think? Yeah. So I sent the pictures to Fiona and she said take them away from Storm, which is what we do because what you guys don't see is sometimes Storm gets in a rage. If he gets too hot, he gets in a rage. If he gets hungry, he gets in a rage. He's like a ragey kind of horse. Let's go see if we can Wait, what the heck is this? Um, it piled up a hole. There was not this big of a hole here. Yes, okay, so Sam and I are having an argument because I've been in this Hi. pasture so many times I've never seen this big of a hole. And he said he filled up a hole. Storm's and thinking it's water. Storm's like, is there water? Oh, don't be standing in the way of a horse when all the other horses spook. Stella's, there, she's jealous, I'm telling you. No. Oh no, she's mad, look at her. I think that's good. She's mad at them, no, uh, Gracie and... Uh, I've never seen her. No. I've never no. seen her act like that no. before. No, Storm's like, mad. I don't want rocks to play. Uh oh, did he eat a rock? Anyway, he put a bunch of dirt here. He says he filled up a hole, but there's lots of rocks. I don't want to have like a lot of rocks in our pasture. I get crazy over the thought of them hurting each other or hurting themselves. So yeah, my point was that Storm will get aggressive if he's grouchy. It's annoying. So it's like trying to figure out why Storm's being like that. So it's either because the grass isn't good and he's bored and he's not getting enough to eat. He's super hot, which has happened in the past. Or, I don't know, there's no rhyme or reason why Storm gets aggressive. It's funny because Sophie always looks so short because she's the shortest one of us, but really she's like taller than 90% of 10 year olds. But yet she looks kind of nine. short. You're 10 in a month. I don't care. I'm not. She's like, I'm gonna live nine until I'm not nine anymore. And the same thing happened to me. Nine is my favorite number because I cried when I turned 10. I didn't want to be double digits anyway. Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today is about being in a bad mood, about things not always being perfect. My friend sent me a message saying, oh my gosh, Laura, I dreamed that this storm got hurt in the mud. And I'm like, there's no mud in his paddock. Laura wakes up in the morning and there's a big pile of sand in the paddock that's gonna turn to mud when the rain comes. Yeah, and that happened. Like, I don't even know how these things happen. Anyway, good morning, welcome to today. Today is the last day of rest and relaxation before things get crazy because tomorrow, Gracie is gonna learn what her job on the day by day farm is. All right, are you guys hungry? Is that what's happening? Did dad not give you enough food this morning? Stella, you be looking good, Mom, sister. People are paying me 10 bucks to get lemonade. On Roblox. On Roblox. So maybe that's a sign that in your life you should have a lemonade stand and make and become rich. The lemonade stand is also rare. Yeah. But what I want to know is who would pay ten dollars for lemonade? That's just insane. All right. So it is lunchtime. We are gonna feed and then we are gonna hit the road. Hit the road, Joe, because we have places to go. Which reminds me, next week hopefully it'll be warm because our local beach is about to close for the season and we're gonna take our three big horses and go for a ride at the beach, which I'm excited about. All right, oh my gosh, Stella, you've been rolling. All right, let's feed. It is bird season. Do you guys know what bird season is? Bird season is when there's like a lot of birds everywhere. And when we used to live in the, in the country, can you hear them? Ben's waiting for me. I know, let's go throw them some hay. That's just the fence. No, listen to the birds. Oh yeah, so guys, let me tell you about this season. It's a season where all the birds come it's and cool. race across the world. Yeah. yeah, like literally, 
they do circles around the boys in the paddock. Like they just fly around in circles like ginormous bugs circling Storm. And Storm looks up and he's like surrounded by all these birds. It's horrible. We come home and there's like tons of hay left and we know that they don't need it. But yeah, I'm nervous. So Brandon told us to shut down the paddock October the 1st and Can assume and I stay here. And assume that they're not getting enough. <laughs> have you guys noticed? Tell us. Have you guys Why noticed? So dirty. Yeah, well, when you have horses, you're always dirty. But guys, have you guys noticed how much that horse loves how much that horse loves you? Like she literally Can you walk up to her now? Yeah, like if he sees the halter, she runs. Yeah, well that's a mini thing. But yeah, like she loves Sophie like crazy. leaves in our bucket. Ooh, I made it. Yay. So here is my lesson on grouchy. Whenever I feel grouchy, it's only because of two reasons. I'm very hardly ever grouchy. Unless I'm starving or unless I'm really tired, so at night. So only like two times a day do I ever feel grouchy. Fire, fire, fire. <laughs> Why? Fire, you're cutting off my head. How often am I grouchy? Like every single day. Yeah, like two times a day, and only no, two like times a day. All day. So up to the house we go so we can eat. Look. Come on, let's go eat. It's a grasshopper, but he's dead, so let's, he gets let's, to live in peace. Let's go eat. Oh, and nobody's perfect. We all have issues, but if you are feeling grouchy, make sure that yeah, you're not you hungry. Like two seconds ago. Yeah. Like, we need to go eat. Yeah. Emergency situation. I need food. Okay, so if you guys remember, at the last horse show, uh, Gabby won a gift certificate at this place for horse treats. So, $25 in horse treats. And so we're here to claim her prize. You ready? I'm ready? Get something. And Sophie just has her bank card, which means that she's going to buy... Cash and cash and she's just gonna buy whatever she wants but we're gonna look around yeah. and see what Gabby can get. Ooh, they have horse stuff. Look there, there's your color, Gabby. Uh, no, yeah, kind of. Look, that's a sign. Stella's ready to go out on the grass. All right. $25 in apple chunks. Oh, that's a nice one. Ruby would love that. So that's all they have. You should take these anyway. So this store actually has... We already have enough of this. They have this thing. And we are thinking about something like this because it's an automatic waterer. <laughs> Because it's probably it's hard. If that would hurt. It's Ooh, a mane and tail me. brush. All right, let's go pay. So that was pretty cool. Gabby won uh, treats. We had to just come and pick them up. She won a certificate for treats. Let's see, Gabby. She got three uh, big bags of treats, which is amazing because you guys may not know this, but we are the treat family. We go through a lot of treats. We're at a stage where we have like, barely any treats. Yeah, we're at a stage right now where we have like. Uh, three quarters of one bag of treats, I think. So this is it. Apple chunks made with apple pomace. Treats for horses. She got three bags. Storm Hopefully Storm likes them. All right, who can guess where we are right now? Okay, now I'm gonna tell ya. <laughs> we are at the trailer. Uh, we yeah, actually, on we actually have to close this sucker up very, very soon. Are you sad? We hardly got to spend any time at the trailer. Yeah. The girls hate it here now because there's no internet and there's they're no at that. Yeah. I think I have data. Yeah, but they're at that age now where they don't want to be where there's no internet. I think our life at the trailer is doomed, you guys. I think we're gonna end this thing. Like. We, all, we won't end it now. We're either going to get a new one, a new trailer next year. This one's getting old. Um, or we're not going to have a trailer at all. And I'm starting to think, like, I think we're done with this. 
think back to like 20 years ago in your own life if you're old enough think back 20 years life changes so fast you're probably living a completely different life than you were 20 years ago 20 years ago I my oldest son was 10 20 years ago I had a 10 year old boy an 8 year old boy and uh two-year-old boy so yeah I had like a bunch of little boys at home I worked outside of the house and Sam worked and I mean Sam still works and yeah we had like a really busy crazy life 20 years ago and now I have a really crazy busy life with two girls but yeah life changes so much and I think we've outgrown this trailer Okay, so we just got here and literally there's a lineup outside the door. One thing is you never let Gabby go first because she always takes forever. No, not as much as Sophia. But Sophie, come on already! This is the thing that I always loved about being at the trailer is that the girls, the girls get so bored that they play cards. They get so bored that they play with each other. like the girls grew up here especially Gabby and now what the heck is that That's and now I feel like it's the end of an era having our horses makes me not want to go anywhere else be anywhere else mom we're stuck it says we never we never wanted to be here in this summer it's just crazy to me how we could love something so much and then we've changed and we love something else so much more well we're gonna get another trailer because um yeah I wanna come here and swim too sometimes. Maybe I'm a bird following the seasons. This is what I've learned. I'm different for a reason. Kept the engine on never stay too long. I'm alright, I don't mind being restless. Crazy to me to watch the horses come to the girl. Oh, you're coming to me now. I got nothing. I got nothing. Let's see if you like them, Stormy. I can't believe you. He rolled in his fly mask. But that's amazing that you won like fun horse treats. I love winning. Yeah, like twenty-five dollars worth of horse treats. Storm approved. but I'll eat them, they're good. And Storm's like, give me more. So the girls are here with the boys. And then over there, the girls be watching. Something in your eye made me stay all night. I can see you are different too. They know where the treats are. Ponies approved. I guess Gracie's the boss of Willow now. Gabby, don't make them. Uh oh, it's playtime, girlies. Do it. No, Gabby. Willow's like backing away from Gracie. And you get to. I think they like them. I think a fight is about to ensue. Willow is shutting Oh my god, I have hay down my shirt. I have hay down my bra every day and in my purse my every shirt. day. I gotta go give the boys water. Storm's licking the bucket dry. She's like, oh no, I've been caught. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, Will is actually shoving her nose. Yeah, in the time to play with the ponies. Will's like, yes, I get to jump. Seriously though, this is what this is what's been happening in the last week. Every night just before supper, the girls want to come down and play with the ponies, and I go 
and sit in the backyard, sit at the arena on the lounge chair. I can read my book, I can do whatever I want, and they just play. I have a following, I have a new <laughs> Gabby is a horse magnet. <laughs> you are so cute. But he kissed me multiple times. He won't do it here. Because he sees the bag. He would smack his lips. Oh, it's because he doesn't have a stall guard right there. He likes you. He's like still getting to know you. He's like, you're a stranger. A song meant to be heard, but never meant for preaching. I don't know where you're gonna head off to, but I know that you'll go where your heart's at. You might cross the sea, what will be will be. Wanna make this adventure with you.
don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.